You handled your role well. So, my performance was acceptable? Yes, Your Highness. We should now be able to achieve our objective. Let them loose and follow them to the truth. And what will we gain from this exercise? When we have proof they work for the enemy, we'll lock them up again. They'll give us excellent leverage in negotiations with Ura and beyond the negotiations. We stand to gain information about Grand Staff. Grand Staff? Ura has built a gigantic magic engine called Grand Staff, and we suspect they're plotting something. Right now, Ura poses a terrible threat to the entire world. A threat? Our intel has confirmed that the tragedy at Wool Highlands is connected in some way to Grand Staff. If we continue to allow Ura to run rampant, that tragedy could be repeated again at any time. The authorities in our military have voted unanimously to seize Ura as a preventative measure. You plan to start a war? The White Boa is already being converted into a battle flagship, and we've begun assembling troops and arms. This action is for the sake of the entire world. I won't allow it. While your majesty may have other ideas, the people will surely approve these safety measures. In this present magic industrial revolution, your majesty's isolationist policy is pushing the nation to its limit. National isolation promotes peace. <gasps> this new regime must be created for the sake of world peace. We shall spread your majesty's teachings using our nation's military might. You think military force can avert violence? Would you rather see a media fall on Numara? If that were to happen, the people who so adore you would be reduced to ashes in an instant. No. The Grand Staff should not be in the hands of those simple-minded fools in Ura. We Numaran should control it. Then we can use it to maintain peace all over the world. Numara would become the most powerful, peace-loving country in the world. War is inevitable, your majesty. They should just keep quiet, play their role, and smile. Someone get in here! Now! Alright, we're back. We just saw uh, Ming faint. That's always fun to watch. Anyways, I just skipped like 800 people, so let's talk to them. <sighs> Uh -huh, I heard all about you guys. Welcome to the city of Numara. Oh, thank you. What? You lost something? I'm busy here. Go ask someone else. So oh, fuck you. All right, that's enough for a break. Back to work. When I'm tired, walking. When I'm tired, walking down this patch helps me recharge my batteries. You know the big magic engine in the public square is called a magic monitor. Fucking talk. Numara's main street is up ahead. Don't cause any problems or I'm taking you in. Ah, uh, you guys must be travelers, right? I recommend the inn over there for you, then. Sighing. Time to kill another day's trolling around the magic wanderer. Bah! I was walking next to the palace and a soldier chased me away. Oh good, whoop whoop their ass. Hey, uh, you see the sparkling thing over there? You know what it is? Um... No, not really. I thought it- I thought up a good luck ritual. You throw a coin over your shoulder and into the fountain and make your wishes come true. What do you think? That is so original. You... Ma'am... Are... A god... Among women. I see more and more buildings in the Moro equipped with magic engines these days. Must be the magical industrial evolution in action. Oh, the wrong person. I'm getting very hard to stay. It's getting very hard to stay in the Moro. Uh, none 
of this would happen if Kling Mean would use her power that she has at her hand. What do you want? I'm not here to strike up, a, strike up a conversation with you. Ten gold, not bad. There's some pretty strange folk gathering around the street. They're like artists or something. You can see the works of almost all of New Orleans artists if you go to the saloon over there. Oh yeah. I'm tired of it. He is the one who suggested going on a gone look for a date. But just how long does he expect me to wait? Oh, hello there. Have you been to my shop yet? I mean, this place where I work, the Nin's Luxury's place. You're welcome anytime. Oh, but the soldiers have been breathing down my neck lately, so you'll need a password to enter the main showroom. Once the clerk stops you, tell him that you're on the Tautomus recommendations from the salon. Tautomus is the brother of the salon, saloon's owner and he's one of our best customers. Don't forget the password. enough of this place. Everyone needs a breather, so I guess I'm taking in. Time to ransack the inn. There's no way this can be anything. What's in here? What's in here? Ten G.
Mint powder. Let's double check and make sure I can't do that one. No, I cannot. See you next episode.